Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'd habatu fillah I wanted to encourage myself and my brothers and sisters to be positive to set goals to look for positive outcomes and all of this comes by trusting in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala but taking steps and as we've mentioned countless times about the importance of tawakkal on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that some of the scholars they define tawakkal as itimad ala Allah wa fi'l asbab as depending on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and striving uh making taking the uh, actions in order to achieve your aims. So it's very important for you to try to develop good habits and to be disciplined and to be driven and to be confident and to strive to uh, not be afraid of failing. And this comes with your seeking knowledge, doing talab al ilm when you're striving on that path to Jannah, that you've got to be relentless in trying to achieve your goal. And if it is a physical goal <coughs> as well, <coughs> in being a balanced human being, then striving your best to achieve your aims. And likewise, uh, uh, if it is a spiritual goal, which we should all have spiritual goals, then is striving your best to be your best in your worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that means going in accordance with the sunnah of the Prophet, alayhi salatu wasalam, that you have ikhlas lillah, and you are striving in accordance with the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wasallam. And it does not harm you at all to write down these goals, to keep them in your mind, to keep striving to go forward, to be balanced. And for me, I strive to have my own personal goals, that things that I want to achieve and attain. And I'm trying to learn to discipline myself in order to attain those things that I want to get. And some of the things I have been able to actualize min fadli la subhanahu wa ta'ala because I was rel relentless in trying to attain certain things that I wanted. And that came with things as far as my studies, as far as certain achievements personal achievements. So set goals for yourself. Set things you're always striving for. Striving coming to, to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, that's the ultimate because that is what we're created for. I have not been created, I have not created mankind in the jinn except for the purpose of worshiping me. But that's very general. Many people acknowledge that, but they don't really make effort to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on that level. We often forget we need to make ethical, we need to make dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So it doesn't hurt you to set goals, set realistic goals, write down things, write down your plan and your your the things you want to attain and achieve in order <coughs> to gain that ultimate goal of worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And for me, Wilillah alhamd, one of my own personal physical achievements, I'm on the path to achieving. Go ahead. Bismillah. Bismillah. This is easy, easy work right here. So strive to be your best, strive to do your best, and strive to achieve your best. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam and don't let anyone take that from you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.